For the first route, we are going from LAN 1 to LAN 2. We will configure route number 1 on router 0. The first parameter we need is the destination network address. Here, the destination network is LAN 2. From the topology, we know that LAN 2's network address is 172.16.1.0, slash 24. So, we will write 172.16.1.0, in the place of destination network address parameter. The next parameter is destination network mask. From the topology, we know that LAN 2's subnet mask is slash 24. This translate to 255.255.255.0, in decimal notation. Remember, router only understand the decimal notation but not the slash notation. The last parameter is the next hop IP address. The next hop IP is the IP address of the interface on the next hop router. Next hop basically means the next router that router 0 will forwards the packet to. Let's look at an example. Suppose that PC0 sends a packet to PC2. The packet will go from PC0 to the switch, and then to router 0. Router 0 then forwards this packet to the next hop router, which is router 1. This packet will arrive at the interface FA10 on router 1. Notice that router 1 has two interfaces. FA10 is the interface facing router 0. We can see that the IP address of FA10 is 10.1.1.2. Now, we will write this IP 10.1.1.2 in the place of next hop IP parameter. So, there you go. That's the full static root command to go from LAN 1 to LAN 2. Thank you for learning networking with Avocado.